Howdy Philippines, this is Vernon Velasco with your daily dose of the hottest news from the Daily Tribune. But hold on, before you dive into work emails, let's not forget Sunday's Mother's Day. That's right, time to brainstorm some surprises for the amazing woman who keeps the world spinning. Maybe breakfast in bed? A heartfelt card? We'll have some inspiration coming up later in the show. For our top story, the Department of Agriculture is confident that proposed amendments to the rice tarification law will stabilize prices to as low as 30 pesos per kilo. Anli Rice, anyone? In business, SM Investments Corporation saw a 6% increase in first quarter earnings. Banking was biggest contributor, followed by property and retail. BDO Unibank, China Banking Corp, and SM Retail also reported rising net income. Way to go, SM! In show business, the cast of High Street is back for a sequel. The Gen Z drama will see the return of our favorite stars and a ghost from the past season. Guess what? Piolo Pasquale's movie, Maliari, is a top contender at the FAMAS Awards with 14 nominations. The historical film, Gomberza, also earned 12 nominations. Do we see fans crossing fingers? As promised for this Red Letter Day Sunday, Mother's Day is coming up. Treat mom to delicious cakes from Monique Cakes PH or Honey Bun Cakes and Pastries. In sports, National University Lady Bulldogs are back in the UAAP Women's Volleyball Finals after walloping Far Eastern University. They will face the University of Santo Tomas in a best of three series. That's it for today for Daily Tribune's news in a hurry. For more news and updates, visit our website at tribune.net.ph. Don't forget to follow us on social media. Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok, all at, at TribunePHL. Stay safe, Philippines. Chill.